Coming to you from the Strack and Van Til Studios. This is your 219 News Now. Strack and Van Til, making customers' lives easier for 93 years. Hi, I'm Sonny Santana, and this is your 219 News Now. A St. John police officer faces criminal charges in a November gun attack on an off duty Hammond officer. Police say Philip Fabian fired at the Hammond officer's moving vehicle about 2.30 in the morning of November 29th. Fabian claimed in court records that the Hammond officer attempted to run into him while he was on foot. Hammond Mayor Tom McDermott said Wednesday that Fabian disproportionately responded. No one was hit by the bullets. The Lake County prosecutor charged Fabian with felony criminal recklessness and misdemeanor criminal mischief. A 57-year-old man nabbed with child pornography videos, including of children estimated to be as young as four years old, has been sentenced to six years by Porter County Judge Jeff Clymer. Harold Harvey of Burns Harbor pleaded guilty to a felony count of possessing child pornography. Charging documents show that investigators served a search warrant for Harvey's Facebook accounts and found 897 videos involving child pornography. One day after former Indiana Governor Mitch Daniels bowed out of the U.S. Senate race, former President Donald Trump declared that Northeast Indiana Congressman Jim Banks has his complete and total endorsement. The endorsement wasn't entirely unexpected. Donald Trump Jr. last month joined in condemning Daniels as a Republican in name only, calling Daniels Mitt Romney 2.0. And in sports, Michaela Best's three-pointer with two and a half minutes left helped lift IUN women's basketball past Governor State 58 to 44 Wednesday night. Here's a clip from the broadcast on Jet TV. Martin with the ball, puts it on the floor. Trying to go around Davis, did a nice job to stay in front. This is Best for three. Got oh yeah! Ball. Michaela Best, who has struggled with her shot at times this year, 26% from deep. Drills the triple, the lead is 10. The Red Hawks are now 14-2 in the CCAC Conference. In girls basketball sectionals at Lake Central, Munster beat Maryville 56-52, and Lake Central beat East Chicago Central 60-15. To, to read more on these stories, head to NWI.com. I'm Sonny Santana, and this was your 219 News Now.